How's it going, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back. I hope you're doing well. Today, we are playing a game called Rental. Uh, it's a game on itch.io. It's quite high up. It's, uh, you, from the looks of it, Animal Crossing meets horror. Take that as you will. Before we get started, if you do enjoy all this itch.io horror content, be sure to subscribe and ring the bell. It helps me out and lets you guys know when I have a new video out. So, with that being said, let's just crack on. Um, yeah. Just straight off the bat, it does... <laughs> it's basically just like a 3D Animal Crossing. Or like the... Um, oh, what are they called? It's like the Sylvanian family? Like the little a rabbit, like Lego motherfuckers. Um, space, okay. Dad, what do you think? Umi, it's not too shabby. That's not as good. Bro, do you want to play with me? No, no, okay, okay. Um, I guess we... Um, we're in a new house, I presume. We've moved house. Quite a cosy little place, so to speak. Oh no, you close the door. Hey, open up. If I'm the one inside, it won't open. Weird. I should find that, I should find that dental rental, rental man. Okay. Oh. <laughs> okay, <laughs> good start. Oh, it's creepy. I should find that dental rental man. What, who is this? What? But the rental man is like... Oh, I can just go in. Oh, I thought I could just... I thought they were all locked. Okay, I'm gonna find the person apparently and not just randomly press things. Oh, person. Hello. Rental man. You, did you come from outside? I've been trapped here for weeks, months. I don't even know anyone. I don't even know anymore. Um, I need to get the keys. My parents are... Forget about your parents. You'll never see them again anyway. Unless. Unless what? You, you'll have to perform a ritual to exercise this cursed place. Yes, that's it. I can't do it myself, of course. I'm just some helpless rental man. But you, you're a little girl. Who else could do it better? I... You, it even, like, the, the talking even sounds like Animal Crossing. Which is just very odd. Uh, you need to find the ar the artifacts. It's, uh, let me see, six crosses. Okay. A woman behind bars. Some angry man. No, not me. Three candles. And then... Uh... <laughs> Hang on, what? Man just materialized in and out of space. Wait, I think you should know. There appears to be a secret room somewhere in here. I don't know how to summon it, but some of the stuff is probably there. Good luck. And he just phases in and out of reality again. Okay. <laughs> Looks like a good place to hide. Uh, all right, six crosses. The TV looks kind of fuzzy. Six crosses. So that's one, is that one of them? Yeah, okay, cool. Can't reach the cupboard. Okay, can I? Find a wooden stool, okay. Does it just automatically, it does. Ah, okay, so it does like automatically do it, right. Chains, was it, this? A random woman with a baby. Okay, so it's not that one. Um. um I, what? <laughs> no problem there. What, why, what was that noise? Oh, two candles, okay, so six candles, some cross, no, three candles, six crosses. A, a woman in chains used the wooden stool to reach the cupboard. Ah, there's a cross object. Okay, that's good. Um, no dirty dishes, right? No problem. Is that it in here? There's no kind of running element to it, I guess. Four chairs. Hmm, my brother should eat outside. <laughs> Got him. What's this? There's a man, but he doesn't look angry. There's a woman, but she's not behind bars. There's some ugly kid too. Okay, so a man in a man behind bars as well. I, I'm not. I'm not feeling these noises. I don't think I can use this. Okay. A, a, a cute necklace. I was wondering what that was then. Right. So in here, we didn't actually fully look in here, did we? I can hide. She says. What about this? Oh, a key. Okay. Oh, um, where was that? That was locked, wasn't it? There's something that was locked. 
in... Nope. Which room was it in? This? Nope. There was something locked. Where was it? Oh no, this is where my memory is like terrible. So, this is that main room, that's a bedroom. Into this room? This one. This one was locked, right? Yes. Clothes, clothes. Ah, cross thingy. Nice. Okay. One eternity later. Uh, okay. There's nothing in the drawer either. I am very confused. I won't lie. There's the TV. Can I even press, like... No. I am very much confused. Have I broken the game, maybe? I'd be quite impressed if I had broken the game, just because... There's, a, there's been a few times now where I've semi-broken the games. Right, let's, let's just crack on, shall we? We know where we go, we know what we're doing. Right, let's just do everything in this room. The key, right. So I found a key. Right, one. Cross. Uh, let's use the stool. And then let's go back here a bit. Two candles. Apparently I can go up on the sofa though, which is a new new one. Oh, a candle. Okay. Nice. Um, random one with a baby. So not that one. Into here. Anything to eat? Guess not. Another cross. Two crosses. Three crosses? Some crosses. Been in there. Use the key, close, and a cross thingy. Okay, so that's another cross. Uh, nothing then in here because these are just random little things. An angry man. Yep. Is there anything hiding like down the side? No, I don't think so. I think the character like looks at the um, kind of looks at the angle. One behind bars. There we go. I knew I'd broke. I'd, I'd either missed something or I'd broken the game. One of the two. Either way. Either way. Um. Oh, oh, this is a very weird little angle. Okay. Oh, oh, hang on, I need to go, right, hang on. If I go back to the beginning, does it do an overview again? No. Fantastic. Um, right. I don't remember what I'm doing. There was a quick overview. I'm pretty, I'm, it must be a pretty simple maze, right, surely? There's no way it wouldn't be. Oh, a cross. A cross. Only two left. Okay, so yeah, so you don't collect them all in the house. I didn't think you would. Mm, some ominous noises. I'm not a fan of this. I feel like I should be paying attention to like the the reflections as well, but there probably isn't much to it. And I'm probably just overthinking it. One left. Okay. Um. I, I, <laughs> there's two kind of main factors here that I'm really on edge about is the fact that you can't move the camera apart from when you do like left and right kind of thing and then also you just you're so slow ah nuts I hate mazes ah this is gonna be dead dead isn't it correct god damn it okay Right, have I been here before? <gasps> oh, ah, there we go. The last dandelion. Now, do I have to, please don't tell me I have to go all the way back to where I, the, where I came in because I have absolutely no idea. Oh, there we go. The door, the door is open. Ow. <laughs> oh, 
What? Oh, no? Okay, not this way. Um. Oh, I have to follow the chimes, right? Yeah. Whatever, it's this way, because there's... Oh, do I have to go, like... No. <laughs> this is so disorientating. Looks like I can perform the ritual here. I should place all the stuff I have in a circle. Well, how big are you? How big is said circle, my dear? Okay. Apparently, whatever we're summoning is going to be fucking massive. And then something in the middle? Yeah. Looks like I can perform the ritual here. How is everything not in a circle? Oh, I'm just following the chimes, really. Because realistically, something should go here. No? Honestly, just looking for that question mark life. There we go. And then last one. What did I even say? That useless man just disappeared on me. Okay, here goes nothing. Perka... Hello. I don't, I'm not even going to attempt to say that. I'll be honest with you. Ah, oh, okay. <laughs> Hello, Ertha Umi? Uh, seems like your rental man was not here yet. Might as well unpack where we can. Oh, never mind. The door is open. Could you go check? Hmm. I don't think we should go inside the house. Uh, what? What just happened? Was it all just a dream? That was a fun little game. Regardless. Like, I can't fault it. What? Like I, I think I, there's a there's a fine line between every single game that I play on itch.io that I just kind of just I'm so confused about because it's such a weird little like a weird little game and there's not really much story to it. But that was fun. That was a good little cute little game. So yeah, that that was rental. Uh, as always, I will leave a link down below in the description if you guys want to go play it yourself. If you add a bit more to the game, you maybe expand on the levels, maybe the bit on the story. X, Y, and Z things that you just kind of do with generic games. It could be a good little game, maybe a bit more of a backstory as well. One thing I would probably change is the cameras. The camera angle is very odd. Um, it is very kind of Resident Evil 1 and inspired, where it's very much just locked and you kind of, every time you go into a new room, it changes. But that can be very disorientating. Um, but that being said, ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, as always, like I said, there will be a link down below to go play yourself. And with that being said, I will see you around.